Hello there and welcome to this Vicon motion capture tutorial. Today's question is how do I set up a Vicon driven cine camera in Unreal Engine 4 with lens distortion? We're using LiveLink 1.5 and Unreal Engine 4.27 and before we start it is advised that you set up your motion capture volume before undertaking this process. First of all let's create a new project from scratch using the virtual production template. No need to worry about starter content or ray tracing, and the generic name will do the trick. With our project created, let's head into Maps and open the Live Comp map. At this point, we need to create our own SDI media source, the process for which varies considerably depending on your specific hardware situation. Please visit the link seen on screen now and search for the term Blackmagic Video Quick Start. With that done, we then open the Live Link tab to add a Live Link source, because we want that tracking data from the same camera to be streamed into the engine. Now we can see all subjects currently being tracked and streamed by Shogun. Let's select the Cine camera actor within our scene because this is what we want to link our hero camera to. We're going to come down to Details, Add Component and select Live Link Controller. With that new component selected, we have a Live Link Details panel further down. So let's go down to that and set the subject representation to be our hero camera. Now we can immediately see that the Cine Camera Actor view has updated in the scene. Further down this section, we have Roll Controllers. So let's change the camera roll to Live Link Vicon Camera Controller. Finally, let's select the Cine Camera Actor once again, and in its Details panel, come down to current camera settings, manually adding the sensor width and height which results in the focal length being updated automatically. And with that done, the camera is all set up, but let's add a prop to the scene and interact with that to test our distortion. I'm going to drag in a katana as it's roughly the same size and shape as the object I'm streaming from Shogun. First, we need to reset its location values to each be zero, putting it in the center of the environment. I've added the Live Link controller component just as we did with the Cine camera, only this time we wish to use the transform role. Now if I move over to the object in the viewport, we can see it's being tracked nice and smoothly. Up in the Composure Composition tab, let's select the foreground CG layer. In the Details panel, we find the new Lens Distortion section, and the checkbox which allows us to activate or deactivate this. Now if we take a look at the final composite, each layer is looking correct with distortion applied. If you have any questions about this process or others related to Vicon motion capture, please don't hesitate to get in touch via support at vicon.com. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again soon.